Good day, everybody. My name is guitarist Bill Hart, and I am writing for Jazz Guitar Today magazine. And you can find that on jazzguitartoday.com. And my website is billhartmusic.com if you have any questions on what I'm about to go over. I am going to give you a, an example of what I have in my solo jazz guitar book. Basically, it's kind of the modern guitar today, but it can be used in any style of music, whether it's jazz, funk, or rock. And what that's going to be is we're going to talk about just a dominant chord, because you can pretty much find that in any style of music. That dominant chord is going to be the root, third, and flat seven. Okay, and the scale that goes over that is a C mixolydian mode, which is... Okay, what that means is it's just the right notes that work. You don't have to get caught up in modal stuff, but that's all the right notes that work. And what I like to do is apply that to the chord. I have students in the past that have asked me, how are they getting all these other chords on the neck when it's just one tonality? And basically, this is what it is. It's a C7. So those are the main notes that create the harmony of a C7 chord. And then I'm going to put the top note of the scale on top of the chord. So I'm going to have the first chord as a C7 with the root of the chord on top. Then I'm going to have a C9 with the 9 on top. Then I'm going to do another C7 with the third on top. Okay. I'm going to do the C11 or a C sus with the 4 on top or the 11 on top. Do a C9 chord and that's going to have the 5th on top. Okay. Then I'm going to add the 13 or the 6. It's really the 13 when you have the flat 7 in the chord. We call it 9, 11, and 13. Okay, there's a 13. And then I'm going to have a C7 with the flat 7 on top. I'm going to have a C9 with the root of the chord, the C note on top. I'm going to continue going up the next octave with a C9 chord with a 9 on top. Then a C7 with the 3rd on top. Okay, and then I can raise my pinky and get the 11 on top. Okay, so those... Okay, thank you very much everybody for joining me. Be sure to tune in to jazzguitartoday.com. There's a lot more great writers on there. Uh, giving out some really good information. I hope you do well on your journey. And if you have any questions, check me out at billhartmusic.com and we will talk to you next time. Thank you. Have a good day.